guys, it's Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting Reen to episode 10 of Lapis Relays. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm. I should also have a bottle of water. So I'm not going to put it after. Okay. Bring to your home of all we like. Bring our home. Poor baby. I know you don't want to come home. That's girl. I wonder how this is gonna go down. I mean, oh, She just wanted to be a normal girl for a couple of episodes. What's wrong with that? Oh, but you left without permission. Yeah, I can see why everybody's bad. Don't compare her to her sister. She doesn't want that. Yeah, same comparing to the sister. She's so pretty. Mm. 
right. And you can't just go off on your own doing things that you want to do. Eventually, when your sister, you know, becomes a queen and your second... No, when your sister dies, you're going to be the next on the throne. And eventually, it is going to be your turn. Excuse me. I like it too much. Oh, she's so freaking similar to um, Nadoka from uh, Healing Good Pretty Care that it's not even funny. But she's getting worse, isn't she? There's something else she's hiding. Well, whatever it is, it's not good. But I get the fact is why she wants to hide it from her older, her younger sister, but still. <laughs> I think maybe because she's used to it. Um, that, or maybe she had a cushion. Uh. They just got here, so three extra more days? What are you guys gonna say? Or you get to sneak in? <laughs> really love me. Mm. 
I mean, I think you guys can really sneak and, like, get through that hole, but... Yeah, but let's just hope you four don't get caught. <laughs> Maybe it would have been better if you four would have worn like all black or something. So then you could camouflage, but because y'all are wearing light colors. <laughs> Yeah, but your feet. <laughs> oh, nutty. <laughs> Like a rat or, or something? Oh, okay, yeah. Cody, what is oh no, that's the come here, baby. There you go. Yeah, but still, wouldn't it be better for you guys to change into a different color of clothes? I'm just saying. But be careful. <laughs> oh my god. Let me! <laughs> See, I would say, like, put disguises on and, like, change into the guys' costumes, but since it is nothing but all guys. <laughs> Where's Ashley? Oh, there she is. Nice try, though. Yeah. 
If only Tia was walking around as of right now. Oh my god. Of course it would be Lavi's hand, right? This girl! Love mm -hmm. All I care about is my stomach. I still love you. <laughs> but Lavi's like, I'm just hungry. <laughs> that doesn't matter. You go for your dreams.
But that exquisite pudding, though. <laughs> yeah. And then you gotta think about your sister, though, too. <laughs> no, Nanny, you said the right thing. Oh my god. And let me guess the school that you were all going to is the only school that does that. No. I mean, but yeah, you're going around the whole freaking world. <laughs> of course, I. You know that's why. What else was Lavi gonna say? I'm hungry. <laughs> This girl, I love Lavi so much. Lavi, <laughs> Lavi gives me so much feels to Hanayo, but it's not even funny. Like if Hanayo, um, especially not like, hmm, okay, if Hanayo and I'm trying to think of another love live girl, Hanayo and uh, Kotori. If Hanayo and Kotori had a baby together, it would be their mixture of Lavi and Nettie because they're very similar. I mean, Nettie is the shy one of the group, but she does not. She's slowly but surely speaking out, but Lavi is the one who was just like, I am hungry. And Hanayo was up with. Hanayo wasn't really hungry all the time, but if she wanted some rice, I mean, I. No, actually. It would be Hanayo and Honoka's love child because Honoka loved to eat nothing but bread and Hanayo loved to eat nothing but rice. <laughs> and Lavi just loved to eat. <laughs> but oh, they're back together. That's all that matters right now. I mean, Elsa, I don't know what else to say about her. I love the fact that we got to see her more in this episode because she's best girl and I love her so much. Yes, she's being a little hard and bitchy, but she has a right because of who she is and how high she is on her, on like the food chain. Oh, come on! What the fuck was it, though? Don't tell me it's some BS, like the school's gonna close down, close down or something. I mean... I swear to God if it is, because that's the only thing you can immediately kind of think about, because since this show is very similar to Love Live, in a way, except the thing is, they're witches and not schoolgirls, but still at the same time, they are schoolgirls and they're not trying to save their academy. The only thing I can really compare to it immediately with what Chloe just said, aka Ellie's uh, voice actors from Love Live, to the possibility, yes, the school is closing down. If it's not the school closing down, I have no freaking clue what that could be. 
but with all these little moments from the preview and going into really sentimental sad moments and then especially with the music it seems like it's something that is thinking about yeah the, the school's getting closed something bad is happening and so i hate the fact that they literally did like mm, a shot where it's her in the school and then we're gonna show outside while it's raining to make it a little sad and depressing but still at the same time a little bit of like mm, here's our like problem right now we're on that problem then we're getting down towards the solution because we just finished one we saw one problem but here's another problem that we gotta get get ready and get ready for um whatever it is it's just it's so freaking bad and angelica since she's with um lucifer i think whatever it is it's gonna affect them as well it's gonna affect everybody in the school whether they're a part of a unit or not it's just i don't know i got no fucking clue but whatever it is i feel like it's going to the girls of light and elza and then maybe the rest of the girls of ray everybody's gonna hear about it Depending on what this news is. They're all going to hear about it. Maybe that's when every girl who's possibly gone to this school, um, including maybe some graduates, possibly would come and do something. I don't know. I'm just, this is just guesses I'm going on. I got no freaking clue. And we ain't even going to know until next Saturday, which freaking sucks because I hate waiting. And I really want to know what in the world is going to happen next. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 10 of Lapish Relights. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 11. Bye, guys.